Mick Ronson, you mentioned his name. Oh, he seems yeah. like a the secret weapon almost of that group in a way. Oh, I don't think there's anything secret about him. It's no once again very very nice guy, uh very very down to earth. Not only was he a great guitarist, he was also a very imaginative arranger when it came to strings and brass. Like some of the stuff he did for for David at the end of 5 years uh just what he he writes for strings it's, it's absolutely bizarre and some of the stuff he did on the, the transformer album with lou reed was just i don't know anyone else that would have come up with stuff like that with, with david david was got very bored in the studio he didn't like being in there particularly and so once he'd finished his role he was out the door so that that always left me the freedom that the time that i came most into play with with all of his stuff was transferring the most basic recording and finishing doing the mixing and everything he he was ne he was at two mixes during the entire time i worked with him 